advantage. And rolling by in second spot is Mike Rich. And we've got one in the wall big time. Major blaze down here in turn number four. This is the start of the race, Ken. Again, these guys are carrying a full load of fuel, 22 gallons. Big fire erupting down here in the fourth turn area. Fire crews there immediately. The driver is out of the car. I believe that was Michael Laughlin Jr. His dad builds most of the chassis for the Bush Grand National Division and the Winston Cup Division. He hit, and I think he left part of the fuel tank. It ruptured uh, about 150 feet from where the car is. And that is as bad a fire as we've seen in NASCAR racing in years. And yesterday, they ruptured at least three tanks up here in that third turn crash. This is in turn four. Rescue workers, fire trucks really on the scene quick, really doing a good job getting that fire extinguished. He's already sideways going into turn three. You back see in the, the roof end. flaps come up, backs it in about as square as you can back it. You see some fuel even slinging around right there. Yep. Again, this thing was completely full of fuel. I would say probably the fuel got on the brake rotors or the headers or tailpipes that's already up to a lot of heat and uh, fiery rubs. There you see the fire burning. We're going to see the driver come out of the car right there. There you see him 